Welcome back, Alpha 21 here in the NZ Overhaul mod, and we're here uh, nice, bright and early on top of our Mali Oats, and I'm standing here with my pockets absolutely lined with everything that we had here. I've picked up our Dew Collector, we've picked up our um, Campfire and everything else that was in there, and all of the boxes except for a couple of minor things that we're going to be leaving behind for now are with us. Now, these things, I might pick them up at a later stage, but for now, we're going to go and do uh, that magical sound, and it is time to head down. It's almost 4 o'clock in the morning, and we do not have any of the awakened zombies around, at least not for now, so we're just going to go and head towards our new base. And the plan for today, at least in the morning hours, is, is to get enough set up, because overnight I was just standing there and literally twiddling my thumbs in order to wait for time to pass. And if we're going to go, there we go, um, if we're going to go and we're going to get this place up and running better so I can actually spend time building the Horde base and finishing off the base during the night rather than just standing around doing nothing. Now, this thing needs to go because that will otherwise be completely in the way. That really took forever. Now, I do see a couple of awakened zombies around here now. Did any of them, though, drop any beautiful red loot bags for us? You did not. There is one here. So let's stick our nose in there. See, it was a good idea to move around just before nightfall, just to get those guys triggered. All right, what do we have? Knife guy and, well, some stuff that we already have in our pockets. We do have Mo around and we've got Kenny over there. So let's just gently tap them on the nose as such. And what do you have for us? Um, you can just disappear. The rest of it we shall take because we've got the space in our pockets. Don't have a lot of space left though. We've got 400 wood cubes on us and that should be more than enough in order to get this set up. And we're going to go build you further down. Voy a la playa, voy a subir la marea. Right, so, and with this a little bit of a platform build, we can now actually go and start working further up. So this is going to be where the zombies are going to come from one direction. There we have it from the other. There is a red loot back there. I'm not going to say no to that. There's two of them here. See? It's a good thing that I'm walking around. Um, well, decent amount of coin. That's actually not too bad. There's three of them here. Wow. All right, we'll take you. Um, and now we end up with a problem. Strap you, take that. There we go. All right, last but not least. Electrical traps. Thank you. So we can take everything. You hold on to that. There we go. Now I will read the treasure map because it's close to base anyway. So we're good. There we go. And now I can pick you up. Perfect. Okay, so we try it again. So this is going to be the fighting level and they're going to be coming up here or they're going to be coming up here on this side. And this is going to be our safe space. Now, we're going to be adding additional pillars, and I've got a whole design inside my head, but we know that the Awakened Zombies are three blocks high. I don't know what other nightmares they have planned in for us, so what we're going to be doing is we're going to go three. That's the fighting level of the Zombies of the Awakened. I'm going to go and add two more just-in-case blocks, and then we have our floor. There we go. I was going to say computer says no, but Ducky says yes. There we go. Now, let's get you nice and built all the way up. There we go. And then the next one is going to go right up here. And that is going to be our first level of living level, so to say. Okay, now this is not going to be as much as we would like it to be but for now i'm gonna upgrade you two times can i do three i can concrete perfect giving me a level up as well which is also amazing there we go so those two need to be concrete pretty much straight off because they're going to be very difficult to get to once we start adding the rest of the blocks and the pillars and the supports and all of that
Okay, so there we go. And with that done, now I do have some storage boxes. There we go. It's five of them. And I'm just going to be throwing all of you down right about here. And I'm going to dump everything. Box one. Dump everything from box two. And then you, um, we shall eat. And you can all just nicely stay. For you, we need to have a look. Because I know where I want you. And I know how. The question is how I'm going to get that done. Okay, so I'm going to be putting you in there just for now. Alright, then what else do I need? From here, I would like to have my monies. Um, don't have. Okay, cooking grill, cooking pot. Definitely taking you with me for now. Well, I'm not going to take you with me, but I'm going to use you. And then here we have ourselves a forge because, yes, I was a good boy. And I made a forge overnight. In addition to that, we're going to take you down and for now um this is the highest level what we have so for now we're going to be putting you down here i'm going to upgrade you because i don't want to accidentally throw something or pick it up and destroy something that we're going to need that is one that's two give you a little bit of that now i have been told that mega crushes are easy to make we need the beaker for that and i need coffees now coffee we cannot make yet we need food level 10 Kill, we're at level 9, so we need one more. No, we need one more for bacon and eggs and coffee. Amazing. And then Mega Crush is unlocked already. All that we're going to need is a beaker. Do I have a beaker? I don't think so. Do need the money, though. No beaker yet, but that might change. Then Forge, we're just going to chuck you down for here. Um, we're going to pick you up again. We're going to do a whole lot of other things, but not right now. And for now, we're going to go and get you forged iron. What am I missing? I don't have any clay soil. No, because I turned all of it into cobblestone. You can just stand here, all happy daisy, collecting the water. Perfect. All in all, it's actually not too bad because it is 8.30 in the morning. There we go. And we are pretty much done with... At least a living level up there. Now, I do want to upgrade all of these ones. I'm not going to go all the way up to cobble. Just going to go and stick nicely to wood for these. And eventually we'll get to the cobble upgrading. But I can do that during the night times. So we have the job from Jen from yesterday. Going to be turning that in. We're going to pick up a new job. Quickly bang that one out as well. It is 9.30 in the morning. So we're relatively okay time-wise for that. Then also, I want to have a quick look in the other city. If there's going to be any of the most electronic stores... Because that is where we're going to have the best chances of finding ourselves any of the, um, the electronics crafting magazines things that we need. Here's your pay for a job well done. Duct tape, water, helmet, light mod. Eh, tempting. But I remember now I have a couple of these skill points to spend. Oh, well, couple, one. And you have Daring Adventure, which is giving me more money and better trader items. Is that also going to be better rewards? That's just a better deal. I'm going to try. Congratulations. I can make my payment to the Duke now. Congratulations. I shall take a helmet light mod. Because I don't have one, right? Didn't think so. No. We have a water Good purifier. I knew Not... you could do it. Yes. Uh, stop jabbing already. All right. What do we have? You know? Buried supplies. Well, no. Dell's Cafe. We could do that relatively you fast. Earn some dukes? Could do the radio station. Or the Owens oh, residence. Come on. I've got a bit of a All right, radio station it is. Welcome to KZZ Radio Station. A chicken. Oh, the bunny was slightly faster, but that's okay. I actually need to chuck the meat in the car after we loot the car. There is some of that. And we will also take the scrappy polymers because we're still going to need more of those. What do we have in the pickup truck? Absolute garbage. All right, let's reset you. Let's go back outside. The pickup is now yellow. Still absolute garbage inside. Bicycle, though, is nice within the access area. Let's get all of you in there. You, modify you. You get a helmet light mod. Thank you very much. Now, we don't have anything smelly on us anymore. That is good. Let's pick you up again. The tire back. The tire is back, too. Now, I like the berries and stuff that we get on the other side. Sometimes, they're also just annoying. All right, making use of our helmet light mod. What do we have here? Wiring 101 improves electrical crafting skill. That's good. Not the one that we really want. What is it called? Robotics. 
That's the one. Tech planet. That's the one that we want. All right, so give us some tech planet. There we go. Look at that. See? You ask and you shall receive. Afterwards, you shall receive the invoice and you shall play in blood. So we're not going to be stealthy or anything. There's no point. Oh. Yep. I heard you and I saw the wall. There we go. You please sit down. Permanently. Now see. Oh. There you go. Good night to you two. There's the next one. Anybody in here? No. Nope. Just. Oh, that is cheeky. That is very cheeky. Dodging it. You. That's it. There's nothing else here, right? No, you're locked. You're going back to the other radio channel part. Okay, and that is all empty. Any, mini, miny, mo. We go for this. Nobody here. Any. No toilet pistols. Ooh, agility goggles. We're not wearing anything, so might as well. And where do we actually stand with our agility? I mean, we're now at level two. Um, a run -a gun uh, ooh, gives us parkour, but uh, for that we need level four, so there's going to be more points anyways. Talking about points, we have another one. Now, this one is tempting. That gives us 10 stamina for killing blows. You, though, would give us 10% faster attack speed. No, for now, I'm going to go for the extra damage. And getting the free stamina back. Well, the free stamina back. Yeah, sure. That's how that works. But getting the additional stamina for killing blows. Then the next one, we can put that in attack speed. Why? You duped me. There you go. You want to take a nap, buddy? Go and take a nap. Some trash up here, though. Temper blade schematic. All right, and I'll take the rest. Let's search the shelf from seven miles away for a Forger Headbook, which is 8 out of 75. I think the next one we get a 10. Well, 9 didn't give us anything. Another bookshelf. Well, pile of books, Home Cooking Weekly, and Tactical Warfare. Isn't boy Bob not too happy that we're reading his magazines, but oi, it's not like you're going to be using any of it anymore. Have we got anybody else? Yep, definitely. All right, let's do this. Yes, so we can take the fight outside. Yes, Mo, come on over. And your girlfriend. Oi, cheater. There we go. Doom, doom, job done. Thank you very much. Robotics parts. Medical journal. Thank you. 8 out of 75. That is actually quite good. And what do we get here in the cracker book? Now, cracker book boxes can be really, really good or complete another garbage. Technically, we should have a better chance of getting the books that we need. Or, you get absolutely nothing useful. What do we have here? Hunter's Journal, 10% more damage to humans and zombies. Very nice. Ooh, purple back. With a duster. Worth 100 bucks. That's actually pretty decent. Alright, let's go. Let's go back. Is it done? Yes, it is. Okay. Just making sure. If you're, uh... Feeling under the weather. Well, no, but yeah, you sent me out to do that job. Order. Don't spend it all in one place. Yeah, but okay. I wasn't do, planning on. Make sure it's here. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. So serrated so blade can't do anything with you. Cooling measure. Already got one sitting in the box. Well, that's absolute uh, dog. <clears throat> what you're offering here, uh, Jenny? You look like you could handle yourself. Be careful and try not to get yourself killed. Owen's residence. So that one is behind the other one. Let's do that tomorrow. Because today, we want to go and stick our nose inside the other city. And I want to see and find a most power. Alright, there we go. Pockets are empty again. And I did have a little bit to drink. Now, that was more for the stamina regen than anything else. But I cannot... Well, I can make mega crushes. Oh, and I didn't even realize I could make coffees just now because I put four on. Which means that we have reached enough of the books. Good, 10 out of 10. Yep, so what is up next? One more book gives us blueberry pies. You're right there with... 
All right, and naturally, as we're going through the city here, um, there is so many mailboxes. So when I do see them, I will stop. I will hop off and let's go and pick up everything. And while we're here, hello, Mo. See? And we get a book that we need, Python Quality 4. So we can now already make a better one than what we're currently going with. But I hope to get to Tier 5. Potentially tier 6, because I believe the NZ mod allows me to... Oh, nice. To craft tier um, 6 as well. There we go. Another one. That is 8. How many do we need for the next level? Robotics. So, I need 2 more. And that gives me tier 5s. What do you have? Needle and thread. Yeah. Yeah. It's the... Yeah. Needle and thread. As in anything that is not the double pocket mod. Is a mere book. Ten percent more damage with clubs. Not bad, but we're not running club. Um, any mini mini mo chicken. Be careful. All the chance I've warned you. You didn't listen. Now your dinner. Let's take you, and let's chuck the meat in there as well as the. Did murdering that chicken give me eggs? I think it did. Ladies and gentlemen, bacon and eggs is on the menu. If murdering chickens is giving me eggs... I don't have anything smelly on me anymore. Ooh. Okay, I might be covered in blood. That might be a little smelly. Let's go and get to the commercial area. As, as far as it gives a commercial area. Because so far, all that we see here, that is industrial. That looks industrial. That is purple. Chicken. Come here. I want to check this. There we go. No, let's get the knife out. It gives me eggs. Wow, I didn't know that. Four o'clock in the afternoon. Okay, get around. Purple. Purple. Mose Electronics. Purple bag here too. Why is everything purple? What is smelly? Oh, ah. Ooh, yes. Loot back. There right, and some ammo. No, I'm, I'm carrying meat again from murdering the new chicken, dumbass. A Mose Electronics. There we go. Most power. Search the car from the other side of the fence, but... Telepathically, there we go, another one, and then we just have one more, another solar cell, nice, we already have one, that's now two. Pop and pills, we need a beaker too, but it's a tier three. Are we ready to take on a tier three? That looks like that is, oh, a cracker book, cracker cafe, also a tier three, um, but I think we can handle this. Are we going to be able to get it done in time though? Well, only one way to find out. Here we go. And a skill point to spend. Now, what is the smart thing to do? Ooh. No, we set faster attack speed. Stick to what you said before. Don't change what you... Don't make any changes. If you set your mind to something, do it. Because it's only going to come back to bite you in the rear end otherwise. And um, do we have this book? And there we go. We leave you and we take you. Didn't get any assets. Still don't know if I have the book. Maybe I should check that instead of just trying it. What is it? Wasteland treasures. It does have. Alright. Nothing in the trash can. Now I do need to keep in mind. That. Oh. Twins. I do not have any short iron pipe. So I need to be a little bit mindful of that. Because once it is broken. It is broken. There we go. That is you. 5.30pm though. Let's go. Let's clean the rest of this out. All of you. Wakes up. Wakes up.
mean, always I find them by the dozens, except when I need them. But, alright, this place is clear, all of them are out, which means it is time for us to start looting up. I didn't bring my lockpicks. That was stupid. Alright. Let me open all the boxes, then the crate's gonna have to wait for tomorrow, because I ain't coming back here today. And then we also have the entire front room to loot. Yeah, it's going to be a nice looting frenzy around here. quickly made a final round to check but i do think i have all of it and boy was this a hole look at it as in let's quickly sort them so we've got all the books together we've got two armored up books not really what we were looking for but it is nice to have so we now can make ourselves a tier two scrap of cloth armor which is great barrel extender mod one for selling as well batter up volume four knockdown power attacks increase the chance of knocking down your enemy unfortunately it's only a bit bats but sure thing we'll take it then we've got two bow hunters books an explosives magazine which didn't give us anything but okay then we have the four grip mod one forge ahead which opens up the workbench wow look at that and we just made the forge so that's really really good furious fists knuckle wraps don't care handgun magazine okay two handy land didn't open up anything. Knife guy. Tier 2 bone knife is okay. We all we used it for is harvesting. Then we have a lucky looter book to sell. We have a fireman's almanac to sell. We have a spear hunter book to sell. Then we've got the muffle connected mod schematic. One rifle world. Tech junkie volume 4. Which is the robotic turret shells. Then we have the tools digest. Doesn't give us anything but that's okay. One, two, three. Uh, vehicle box which gives us the bicycle but we already have that one so that's good we are on our way for the mini bike but we're aiming for the motorcycle wiring 101 thank you very much that puts us at six out of 100 but look at this tech planet nine nine let's have a look where we're going to end up so right now there we go tech planet we are at um this pipe baton tier four let's see where we're going to get next there we go. That was all of them. Let's have a look. Robotics. So we can make a Pipeton tier 5 and a robotic sledge. One more and we can make a tier 4. That's absolutely amazing. So that's going to get crafted at the end of the day. And I think that was all of the interesting stuff. Yep, we've got a couple of things to sell, which is okay. But let's go and let's turn around. And... What time is it? 9 o'clock. I see a trader. We're right next door to a trader. How blind am I? I was there. That is the purple place. That's where we looted. A you idiot. <laughs> Jolly boy. Hello. All right, let's go up and around. This is where his entrance is, I think. Uh, nice place. Nice place. Joel, nice well, place, but get you today? Um, a job. Would you what do we have? Help me? Most grocery. Nah. I have a task for Malone you. residence. Okay, nah. Maybe. I have a dilemma and could use some assistance. Deracinated so something something. English class vocabulary. Can you fair? Passing gas store. Nah. Buried supplies. Would you consider helping? God bless you. I have no idea what it is, but do you have anything I want to buy? Um, nerdy glasses. Three grand. But that would give me an extra level of intellect. Oh, Anvil buying that. Absolutely. Advanced Bellows, 1,500. So now we've got a really good forge going right there. That is amazing. Obviously, we're not going to get any crucibles. Um, and I doubt that you have a beaker because that is not your thing. But all good. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure. Bicycle is right here. Up. Oi. There we go. Let's go towards our home base. Um... Popping pills, definitely keeping that on the mark. Might be something good for tomorrow. Besides the two jobs that we have now, because we've got two of them. 
But first things first, we need to spend a little bit of time working on the rest of our base. And I want to be home before the night sets in. And we have meat with us. We've got eggs with us. We can make a whole stack of bacon and eggs now. So basically, we're good to survive. Uh, do I have time? No. Still going to loot it anyway. Useless. Absolutely useless. 600 meters, 50 minutes. Yeah, that's not going to happen. So we're going to be coming home with awakened zombies around the house, though. There we go. That was the nighttime noise. So now we need to watch out for the awakened zombies. And don't see any big green things around yet. So it looks like I'm going to be okay until I reach home. There we go. I'm spawning in, I hope. Oh. Well, a little bit of a heart attack, but because of the stupid tree, I couldn't see this place. All right, let's take this thing out of the way because it will annoy me. And there we've got the big green ones. I see one. We can make some forged iron, not a whole lot, but we'll pump it in anyways. What do we need for the workbench? Workbench. So that is on the way. Five duct tape. 100 nails. So we can make five of you. Um, let's hold off on you. Um, let's make first 100 of you. There we go. So that can wait there. Although, hold both of you. There we go. Take one and two. How many do we have? Eh, we need another 77. I hope, mate. There we go. Look at that. Much better. So we've got you. Mechanical parts is what is missing. Yep. And there is nothing I can do about that. At least not until tomorrow. I think it was a relatively successful day. We did a couple of jobs. Um, we got a nice amount of stuff on the go for that. Let's have a look. Pipe baton, tier 5. Uh, I wish we could make the tier 6. I need to find out what's going to open up the tier 6. But there we go. You were on the way. Should be better than this thing. For the love of... You are better. Look at that. That is good. That's good news. So you're definitely going to be better. So yeah, it was a relatively successful day. We did um, the jobs for for Jen. Uh, we found Joel the trader, which I didn't even think... Uh, I didn't even notice him at first, but that's okay. Uh, we raided a cracker book. Got a lot of schematics. So we're doing really, really well on that. That's going to be it for this one. Thank you so much for joining. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, please do support the channel by hitting that like button. Of course, subscribing to the channel if you have not done so yet. So tomorrow... Uh, we've got the two jobs. We've got the treasure map that we need to go for. We've got our lockpicks on us again, so we're good to go for that. And then also overnight, I will do uh, hopefully a little bit more building here. If it is going to be safe with those clowns around. So might actually need to get set up on a fighting spot there too. That I can challenge them. Get them to come to me. Fight them. Clear the area. And then continue building. So it might need to work on that first. All right, but that's it for now. Thank you for joining, and I'll see you guys in the next one.